Hey there. I've missed you. I'm, I'm sorry. News just reached of Rengoku's death. I don't know how to feel right now. I've always kept myself at a distance from the others, but now I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't know what exactly I should feel. I thought things were just, you know, simple, black and white, cut and dry, I, I don't know, I don't know anymore. You're the only person that I truly connect to. I try not to be close with anyone because I'm scared that they'll waste their life on me. And I don't know. I don't know what to do now. Should I try to be more involved with people? I'm just scared that, that they'll make the stupid decision of sacrificing themselves for me. I don't want them to waste their life on someone like me. They don't need that. Yeah. I don't deserve any of that. That would be such a waste. someone to sacrifice themselves, waste their lives over me. You understand that, right? Uh, what a drag. I respected Rengoku, you know. He was the best of us. Don't tell Shinobu that, though. She'll kill me if I say anyone other than her is the best for some reason. Thank you. You know. Thank you for being here. I'm glad that you're here. I got no one else to talk to. But somehow, you always, you always find yourself here, just when I need you.
Thank you. Really, thank you. I, I have so missed your presence. Nothing feels quite the same without you, without you. Thank you for everything. Now I have to show up and see the other Asheras. Uh, it's always awkward seeing the other pillars. <sighs> no doubt Tanjiro will be there. He's a bit clingy, but... I like him. He's nice. A pure-hearted kid, if you ask me. Sister's pretty dangerous, though. You wouldn't mind if you came with me, wouldn't you? Huh. Nah, it's gonna be great to see the look of Shinobu's face when I bring someone. <laughs> uh. It's gonna be hilarious. So, come on, come with me. I would love it if you came with me. I kinda don't want to go alone and be awkward there, alone like always. <laughs>